enter the ram with the rush and the leap, awaking the world from deepest sleep. The gold of the sun on horns and fleece, disruptor, progenitor, disarmor of peace. Marshal of movement, fiery charge, vigor investing the will to enlarge. Thought before action, word before deed, energy sending the life-giving seed. Cardinal fire, the heavenly gift, initiative urging us all to uplift. The Rite of Aries. The Rite of Aries is the initiatory phase of the zodiac experience. Find a suitable outdoor site. Natural surroundings are best for some of these rites and being sure that you will be free from interruption is a vital prerequisite. You should be adequately attired for this type of working and should carry a blanket or something similar to lie upon for the visualizations. Proceed to the site before dawn on the vernal equinox with the intention of making the declaration of faith. Do not worry if the sky is overcast. It is the timing of the right which is important. When ready, face the east and declaim. I contemplate the rising of our planetary star with awe and realize that this same star is echoed in me at the sphere of the heart. Thus, I identify with the universe and claim the inherent right to progress and evolve with it. Begin to walk slowly and deliberately towards the sun, feeling the warmth of its rays on your skin. Breathe deeply and allow your thoughts to dwell upon outer space. Ponder on the millions of stars and planets whirling through interplanetary darkness making the same darkness visible. Sit down and allow your hands to touch the dew-wet grass of your wet nurse, Mother Earth. Then lay supine and close your eyes. Mentally examine your body, allowing your mind to touch every part of it Start with your feet and finish at the top of your head. Feel the blood pulsating and the life force flowing between your physical, etheric and astral sheaths. Become aware of being an individual, of being unique. Now, visualize Aries the ram charging across the sky, his fleece gleaming and golden in the clear bright light. Even he is reincarnated at every vernal equinox. This is the beginning of a new magical tide in your life. So imagine the fountain of life bubbling and rising within your being. Rise with it and stand with arms upraised to the vault of heaven. Say, I, your name, affirm my birthright at this vernal equinox and declare that my solemn intent is to take initiation through the girdle of Venus the starry circle of the zodiac. So mote it be. Now here a candle should be lit or a flame obtained by some other means and the mind brought to bear and contemplate the wonder of fire. Remember that if our ancestors had not discovered it through friction, it would have still remained, even now, a secret of the gods. 
Lie down again, close your eyes and begin the visualization. The god Mars comes striding over the horizon, a huge figure with golden armor reflecting the sun's brilliance. His flaming cloak flies behind him like some gigantic tropical bird. Mars turns and looks down, his sword held high in a huge brawny arm, his burnished shield hanging casually from the other. He throws back his head and laughs, and the god's raw power hits you full in the face. Suddenly, he points his sword directly at you and speaks, his voice booming and echoing across the sky, reverberating in your inner ear. Puny mortal, think not you can aspire to my stature. I mesh with the sun, and sometimes when my lust is strong with the Lady Venus. But since you are here, mark well these words. Distrust any who would seek to subdue your spirit. Know your head to be the seat of divine illumination. Come quickly to this realization, then walk between the horns of the ram and through the celestial circle. I dare you. A bright red ray issues from the sword's tip and speeds through space. When it reaches you, it disperses in a fiery starburst which envelops you entirely. A feeling of elation and power floods your being, and as Mars strides away, his laughter echoing like distant thunder, you automatically raise an arm in farewell. Stand facing the sun and declaim, I am, and as the sun enters Aries, I too enter into the sign of faith and sacrifice through the primal element of fire. At this moment in my life, I initiate a new beginning with new awareness. I will utilize the energy expressed in Aries to burn away the dross of the old self and forge a link with divine love. Here a small token made from iron must be buried in the earth and the action should be accompanied by a short affirmation and a prayer. Just use the words you feel are appropriate for this occasion. These things accomplished, concentrate upon what you will to bring to fruition. As long as you are very sure it is within your capabilities to achieve at this moment in time. Begin to tread a round dance, making the buried object the center of your circumambulations and at a reasonable distance from it. Use your own words, chant or song, whatever you feel right at this time. At the end, stand with raised arms in the circle you have created. Look to the east and say, the earth around the primal sun, my sacred journey now begun. O Lord of life, look down on me and bless my soul's felicity.